Hi, and welcome to the Browser Agent video. My name is Mike. I will be discussing and demonstrating the features of Browser Agent today. We are currently looking at TixChange, an online primary ticket outlet. I'm sure you are familiar with the name Browser Agent, but are probably still asking yourself one question. What resources on a web page, like TixChange, can Browser Agent provide data for? Browser Agent lets you monitor web page load performance metrics and errors. You can pinpoint the performance degradation to the browser, network, or the application server. Browser Agent includes the following features. Browser Web Timings, which includes W3C Navigation Timing API, Browser Response Timings for Dynamic Web Pages, and Load Time for Soft Pages. Metric Aggregation by Browser Name, JavaScript Error Monitoring, and extending the browser agent by adding custom JavaScript. Web applications monitor and use JavaScript for actions such as accepting user information, providing transitional effects, and rendering and even presenting complex data. A non-functional section of a web page likely attributes to a JavaScript error. Browser agent JavaScript error monitoring provides visibility into those erroneous situations. Browser agent uses a global error handler to capture all uncaught JavaScript errors in the current browser window. Browser Agent can collect information about native and custom JavaScript errors within the browser window, generate error snapshots per error, and report JavaScript error metrics in the appropriate business transaction or URL context. Browser Agent creates an individual JavaScript error snapshot per error. Each JavaScript error that occurs on a monitored web page within an interval contains the following information. Browser name, browser version, web page URL within which the error occurred, error description as reported by the browser, error line number as reported by the browser, error column number as reported by the browser, JavaScript source file name as reported by the browser. Browser agent creates an error snapshot for each JavaScript error that it encounters. The stack trace includes the error information as provided by the browser. In the following demonstration, using the TixChange web page, we will use the browser agent to view scripts and their output. To process the browser agent, we log into TixChange as user1 at users.com. By opening developer tools, we can see the default page script. Notice the two script lines, one to include baext.js and the other to include ba.js. We will save this to a file and then look at it in more detail. Here we can see in better detail where we added baext.js and ba.js to the index. We will now save the baext.js to a file. Browser Agent Extension Set Customer ID sets the customer ID and other optional attributes. For this example, the customer ID is set as the user that signs in. Additionally, pass attributes such as user group with the value platinum. This will be shown in the object named as AXA data in the output JSON used by App Experience Analytics. Browser Agent Extension Add Custom Optional Property adds custom attributes to the transaction traces object used by Application Performance Management. The following line of code attaches a custom function report user info to execute immediately after the login form render is invoked. What occurs inside the custom function? The custom function checks if the user ID is present and if the user ID is already reported. After these checks pass, the function calls the other APIs to do the intended work. Now to look at the JSON output from Browser Agent. We will copy the output to an editor and look at it in JSON format to have a better view of what is sent to Application Performance Management and App Experience Analytics.
Here we see the session and resource metrics. As you can see, Browser Agent supports extensibility for many of the CA products. You are able to capture custom events, create transaction delineators, capture custom data such as a customer ID, or create custom measurements. Thank you for watching this video. For more information, visit our website, ca.com education. And for more videos, please subscribe to the CA Educate channel on YouTube.